Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome back to Doom, ladies and gentlemen. Not sure how close we are to the end of this game. Uh, we're coming up to, like, 20 episodes. Usually, single-player campaigns for first-person shooters are not too long. Again, this is entirely blind. I still have not played past this point, so I, I don't really know. I'm assuming we're going to go back to hell for one more level, but that's all I'm assuming. Uh, let's press back and get a feel for what we are doing. We've already completed all of the challenges. Good job, GV. Thanks, GV. No problem, GV. Uh, we need to go to the Lazarus facility. We need to retrieve the yellow access key we need to go to the advanced research complex let's see we've got three more praetor tokens one of which is directly above us have to remember that we've got one field drone and one rune trial and one argent cell all right so there looks to be some stairs to our right over here let's go ahead and traverse these and no doubt above us is going to be that praetor token right over here to the right there you are hello hi nice to meet you don't mind if i do I don't think you mind either, considering you are dead, um, just like everyone else. Let me go ahead and grab all this armor. Lovely. Actually, does that mean we have enough for an upgrade? I don't think so, no. But we can decide what we want next. So, equipment and environment, uh, environmental resistance are fully upgraded. I think the next best would be dexterity. Area scanning is not too much of an uh, issue. And so, yeah, I think dexterity would be the best... It definitely would be. So we need one more token to be able to upgrade that. Let us move on. Where do we want to go? Let's see. There's a section below us that we have not explored yet. And there's a Praetor Suit token down there as well. Looks like we can actually drop down there and deal with all of the stuff. Um, but I think we'll just keep moving on for now, which looks to be up here. Okay, we're still searching for the Ghost Pinky. Let's kill all of these guys. I think we need one more summoner as well, right? Let's take a look at our weapon upgrades. We were fully upgrading the the, uh, the shotgun, which has already been done for a while, and we were fully upgrading the rocket launcher. Yes, we need one more summoner. And once we do that, we'll probably switch to a different weapon or unlock another mod for these weapons um, with a field drone. All right, so we've got a reaper right off the bat, or a reaver, sorry. Been playing a lot of Overwatch, and some of these terms are similar because reaper is a hero and okay why am i even talking about this if you guys play overwatch you know who reaper is all right we have one more of these guys i hate these guys so much uh take that grenade i don't think that's gonna work oh man He's, they get closer and closer and closer and the closer they get obviously the higher the chance they have of killing you get away from me just kidding come close to me so i can have that health all right you take that and while you're staggered you take that and then you can take that as well. Punch you right in the face. Okay, we have one more of these guys. We need to start using the rocket launcher. Oh, of course we can't use the... Oh, my God. Of course we can't use the rocket launcher because it will never keep it. It will constantly switch over to this assault rifle. We've got eight health left. Uh, I think we want to drop down here and hope to God. Well, that works. Oh, you came down. Okay, hi. Mm, get away from me. Here, take that. Oh, that grenade stopped on that pile of whatever it was. But that works. Jeez. All right. You can have that. Yeah, for whatever reason, this game just does not want me to keep the rocket launcher out. But I'll switch to it now. Okay. Let's see. We've got a door over there. We can still drop down, but I'm pretty sure we found everything down here, right? Just that armor was really the only point it would appear. The music's still playing, though. Oh, and that's because we have a couple of pinkies. Okay. Well, that was easy. Wow. Don't mind if I do. Okay, excuse me. Looks like if we can get a grenade behind the pinkies, they die in one hit. Of course, that was a wonderful grenade by me. Or we could just fire the explosive shot behind them. Doesn't seem too difficult, right? Take that. Nope. Oh, yes, I mean. Thank you. I think we ripped out his throat there. All right, we still got something firing at us in the distance. Oh, hi. Nice accuracy, dude. Nice accuracy as I miss him with my grenade. Why do I even talk shit? It always bites me in the ass. Nope. Okay, almost about to get another grenade. We can kill this guy for free probably. And no, no, no. Don't you dare get out of glory. Look how much time we have. I guess it's because he's big and fat and sluggish. Pop goes the weasel. There is our checkpoint. Still missing some health. Getting weapon upgrade points all over the place. Let's see, do we have anything near us? Doesn't look like that's the case. Let's jump up here, though, and get a better feel for our surroundings. Of course, we could drop down and explore that entire section. But my 
thinking process is that if there's that big of a section that we have not explored, we'll probably have to go there. Because usually, well, exactly what I said. If there's that big of a location that we have not been to, that usually means you're going to have to go there at some point. They wouldn't just have that entire place just for collectibles, I don't think. Into the exclusion zones outside the base is prohibited. Highly volatile experiments and artifacts are currently being researched at a safe distance from the base. Your safety in these areas cannot be guaranteed. Great, thanks for the info, friend. And I see you feel drone. Don't mind if I... No, 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 no! Oh, why does it do this to me? Okay, well, we've got a gore nest. Let's kill all these guys first and foremost. Nice, satisfying explosion there. Excuse me. No, 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 no. Have to do this first. Okay. Now, let me jump and you guys can have that. Okay. Nice job dying. Oh, my God. Lots of stuff happening. Sounds like there's stuff behind. More pinkies. Wonderful. Oh, boy. Let's finish off that guy. How did you live? You think you're special? You're not special. Spoiler alert. All right. Take that. Let's go kill that Hellraiser. I don't think we'll be able to. All these pinkies are just constantly charging, but it looks like they're killing their friends as well. Somehow that pinky got in glory kill range, and now he is dead. Okay, we should have a chainsaw, right? I wonder if we can kill the pinkies. I don't think we can, can we? Nope. Oh, we have no chainsaw. We have insufficient fuel is what we have. Okay. A Hell Knight remains. It's so weird that this guy is really one of the toughest enemies. But we found him, like, early on. No, 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 no. Don't try to be sneaky and do that shit when I'm not looking. Bad Hellraiser. Okay. Who else we got? Got, uh, one of these guys. Haven't seen you guys in a while. Oh, I guess that's because we've been in hell. Oh, a Baron of Hell. All right, someone said that we could use the chainsaw on the Barons of Hell. And here's actually some chainsaw fuel. Let's test that out right now. Yeah, liar. I mean, I guess technically we can, but it, the way the comment was worded it made it sound like we could kill it. what is this mega health oh fully maxes out our health and our armor okay that's not that great of a power up pales in comparison to man i need to aim these damn explosive charges higher i keep going right through the middle of the legs Ugh. all right come on big guy your time is over now right, you can have one more just one more here good you can have that one All right, we've got one of these guys over here. Let's wait for our grenade to recharge and then give him a surprise. Hopefully it lands. Pretty nice shot. Didn't even make the sound because they're too far away. Reset crane to base. Let's do it. And what crane is that talking about? That crane, which is going to move over here. But we can still jump, so what's the point here? Oh, we can get up there now. Interesting. Let's go ahead and do that. Can we get up there, though? I don't... No, if we... Oh, well, we can definitely get up here. Secret found. And what secret is that? That is going to be a field drone. Okay. Well... Oh, we were going to use the Gatling gun, not the assault rifle. Right. Um... Okay. Let's just keep with the theme of grabbing one for each weapon. So here we have the... Uh, Gauss cannon. We have precision bullet. Use the weapon mod button to zoom in and charge a high damage shot. That sounds good, especially for bigger guys. And we have Siege Mode. Use the Weapon Mode button to charge... Weapon Mod button to charge up a powerful beam that penetrates targets. Movement is disabled while using Siege Mode. Uh, I feel like Precision Bolt would be far better. So let's purchase that one. And as always, punch you in the face. Okay, we'll try it out, I guess. So we can zoom in and then it charges up. Kind of like Widowmaker's shot in overwatch a lot of overwatch references honestly because i've just been playing a lot um let's jump back over here and see if there's any collectibles that we can find there's a yellow key card area over there let's press back and see what we got okay to the left is a whole bunch of stuff but why would that be to the left if we can cross this well let's go over here first jump up here can't get through that door this is where we grab the chainsaw fuel okay looks like there's nothing over here let's drop back down and go across this don't want to drop into the ominous electrical water though I, I don't know if that was obvious it should be obvious I don't think we want to do that let's jump over here but it looks like there was nothing oh there is something new in this direction all right well 
There's our pinky. We've still got full health. Oh, it looks like the benefit of that power-up, maximum health or whatever it's called, is that it stays. It doesn't wear out, so it's just like a top-off of all of your stuff. Okay. Well. Surprised that grenade killed them all. Let's see, we have a drop down over here, and they were all by some ammo. Can we jump up here? The answer to that is no. Oh, hi. Perfect time to test this out. And it's not even a one-hit kill. Disappointing. Two-hit kill? That's not too bad. Okay, so let's just remember to switch to the gauze weapon, because we've got a ton of ammo for it, too. Anytime we have a big guy like that. Or a reaper. I think that missed, though. I wonder if it works if we get a headshot. Get away from me. Looks like it did. I think we only hit him one time, and now he is dead. All right, I think we've been here before, too, in a different level. Not too sure. Let's grab this armor. It's only going to give us 12, though. Wait a second. It's not even going to give us 12. Come on, now. All right, where are we? Let's see. There was a data log or something that we missed back here. And it's also where our waypoint is telling us to go. Was it in here? Looks like it was. Oh, a health station. Man, the health station and the... Uh, data entries or whatever you want to call them look too similar on the map a nice big plus sign would have done for the health station i think all right, give me all that ammo thank you very much and let's keep moving this way let's see anything down there it does drop down yeah but there's also something behind us let's go this way first huh huh now, where do we go from here? Looks like up here. The green lights will show us the way. Not sure if the green lights were necessary or not. I think I said that they were nice, but at the same time, it's just a little too much hand-holding, I think. All right, enjoy that grenade. Hold on. Be patient. Be patient. Have to destroy y'all's gore nest. You know how it goes. Okay, now go ahead and, and try attacking me here. Have that. Okay, come on, summoner. Oh, he was simultaneously in and out of glory kill, but he's dead anyways. All right, take that. Oh, get away from me. Okay, I totally planned for that grenade to bounce off of this guy's head and land right in front of him. All right, we have one of uh, these. I still don't know what they're called. And one more should do the trick. Down you go. Come on, guys. You're dealing with the big enemies now. Well, I'm dealing with the big enemies. What is this? This is haste. Not the best power-up for this situation, I don't think, but okay, I'll take it. Why did that kill him? Maybe because we hit him directly in the eye? Either that or he took some damage before. Okay, one of you guys, not too scared of you. Take that. wonder if that even did any damage. He did stagger a little bit from that grenade. Okay, down you go. Hi. Hi, big guy. I also wonder if hitting them in the face with the explosive charge does extra damage. Okay. But there's no point using explosive charges when we could just use our free grenades that constantly recharge. Oh, there's also Codex here. Did we grab it? Looks like we did. Kako Demon. Keiko Demon. Kako Demon. I'm going to call it a Kako Demon. Looks like that's what it's called. Okay. Alright. Well, it wants us to go through there. Was there anything else that we could do? There's a Praetor Suit token directly below us. And how do we get to that? Looks like we'd have to explore a little bit more. Can't activate that just yet. There's our dead pinky. And a yellow access card. Watch, this thing's gonna get up with a last wind. Watch, or a second wind. No? <laughs> okay. I guess there's only one jump scare in the entirety of the game. Alright, we need to go to the advanced research complex now. Oh, what do we got over here? Send a team in. I am the head of this corporation. All your work and discoveries here belong to me. He was mine before you even found him. Alright, we had an exchange with Olivia Pierce and Samuel Hayden. Not sure what the implications are there, but I assume it means that they've had contact, obviously, when previously we thought that they haven't? I'm not too sure if that has been clear or not. Regardless, we are now in possession of the yellow key card, which means after we grab all this stuff over here, we can now enter That's through here. Planted. And if this leads us a floor below, that would be wonderful. Oh, look at this. Look at this. We've actually we actually have a collectible up here. 
That's why it always pays to double check. What is this guy? Captain America guy? I don't think so. Baron of Hell model. Patriot guy. Patriot. Hmm. All right. Well, in we go. Well, I should say down we go. Is there any little floor that... It looks like it's going to give us a Praetor, to, uh, Praetor suit token for free. Which is always nice. Let's get out immediately just in case we can lock, lock ourselves out of it. I don't think that's the... Oh, yeah. Look, we can jump up here. Where is this? Looks, looks like it's through here. Hi, buddy. Little hidden. And that means that we can now upgrade Dexterity to have the ability to switch weapons faster. Don't mind if I do. We can also do Quick Hands and then swap weapon mods faster. Quick Hands is going to be perfect. I don't think I'm going to be swapping weapon mods too much. My playstyle is just sticking to what works. I've mentioned this before. And uh, especially with weapon mods, you know, I don't... I just pick the best one and fully upgrade it, you know? Why why switch out what works? Yeah, you've already said this, so we've already been here. Uh, we have another uh, another yellow door, and that is directly to our left. Looks like right around here. Of course it's granted. I worked so hard to get that key card. Not really. Alright, what do we have? Looks like we need to rip that. Rip and tear it apart. Alright, how's it going, boys? You guys can have one, and you guys can... Well, I guess you only needed one. That's okay. Alright, looks like we got one more fight here before we end the episode. Are you dead? You are dead. Who else? Imps? Come on. Your time has passed, Imps. My weapon arsenal is just far too advanced for you and your fireballs. Now, especially when I can one-hit kill you. Oh! Okay, well, that was a quick fight. The tram is now ready to depart. The UAC's advanced research complex will be our final destination. All right, let's do it. Oh, that ends the episode. Or, that ends the level. Okay. All right, so we missed a whole bunch of stuff. Um... But like I said, that's kind of on purpose. I... I feel like we're only uploading this... Uh, series two times a week and I just want to move through it quick uh, quicker than I have been uh, this is not gonna be a hundred percent playthrough obviously uh, rarely do I do 100% playthroughs other than my main Skyrim let's play um, so let's continue hopefully we'll get a check mark or a checkpoint and see what happens Advanced Research Complex. You have the location of Olivia's private offices inside the Lazarus Complex, where the initial invasion began. You must first traverse through the Advanced Research Complex in order to gain access to the entrance of Lazarus. Utilize the tools you find along the way. Hmm, what does that mean? We have all the weapons. Maybe another equipment, like the hologram. Maybe the BFG. I mean, I would assume it's getting pretty close to the end here. I, again, I don't know. Okay, brighter tomorrow. Looks like I was wrong when I said that I thought we were going to have to fight people on this. I can't even move. It's time we meet in person. My office is on the second floor of this facility. Hmm. I wonder if this meeting is going to end with Samuel Hayden's death. Maybe we'll find out in the next episode. Regardless... We're going to end this one here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all there. Bye-bye.